working. I didn't get enough sleep. <laughs> Why the heck is he still here? Why are you shouting? I'm actually sleeping. We kicked you out. What are you doing here? I study at this college now, and I have the right to live here. Got it? This is too much. Why did you bring hay here? Ah! <gasps> Kathy, are you okay? Ah, I messed up my hair because of this jerk. Grab him. Come here. You're annoying us. Break it up. What's happening here? Uh, good afternoon. I came to the campus, and they're trying to kick me out. Right. He should get lost. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? This is our new student. He's going to live here. Come on. I'll show you your room. Let's go, Bella. Idiot. Well, we'll still kick him out. Right, guys? Right. right. Uh, Cassie, you have a little... Shut up. Follow me. Mm-hmm. Put it here. Let him sleep in the middle of the corridor. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Why are you touching my stuff? You'll sleep here now. There's no <laughs> room for you and your chicken in the room. <laughs> are you okay? Did they hurt you? She is the only girl you can date on our campus. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see about that. Yeah. Ugh, he's annoying. He's not planning on leaving. I thought he wouldn't want to sleep in the hallway and would leave immediately. You can clean up your stuff. We need to pass by. I don't care. I live here. What a jerk. What are we going to do with him? I'll sort him out now. Elsa, sick. <laughs> Uh, hey, that's my shirt! Give it here! <laughs> <laughs> it's not a shirt, it's a rag! <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at? You thought I'd be scared? I have dogs like this in the village! And this is just a small mutt! <laughs> what? Who did you call a mutt? Elsa is stressed now because of you! Ugh! Sweet dreams! I'm still gonna live here! <laughs> Nothing helps! <laughs> you need to cheer up. Maybe you'll throw a party for us to relax. <gasps> yeah! We so love parties! Especially on her dime. <laughs> Fine, you'll get your party. Awesome! We're gonna have a blast! <laughs> a party? Oh, yeah! It's so nice without this bumpkin! The party is just awesome! Cindy, spin the wheel! I wonder what you will win! Wow, a trip to Paris? How did you do it? I'm just lucky. Let's see what you've won. Oops, so unlucky. You've won a kick. Hey! Oh, <laughs> that's not fair! <laughs> oh. Ooh, a party. Why wasn't I invited? You again! Enough is enough! I'm your neighbor now, so I'll party with you! How horrible! <sighs> That's it! I'm fed up! Hey! 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 Oh. Oh, hey, hey, uh. Uh. Oh. 
Is this kind of entertainment common in the city? I like it. Gosh, how do we get rid of him? Mm, oh, I got it. You know what I'm saying? We can do this. <gasps> <laughs> Play the lottery, maybe you'll get lucky. Oh, I'd love to. Wow, a swamp holiday <laughs> voucher. <laughs> That's exactly what I dreamed of. Thank you. <laughs> huh? Yeah, you need to be there ASAP. Hurry up. I'll run pack my things. Uh... <laughs> well. He won't last a day in this swamp and leave immediately. <laughs> I hope so. He's really getting on my nerves. We need to make sure he definitely leaves the campus. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Bella! Bella! My little chicken! Someone kidnapped Bella! <laughs> cool. Thanks for helping him send about here. <laughs> <laughs> How will I live without my lovely chicken? But don't worry, I'll find her. He <laughs> lost his chicken too, loser. Bella, is that you? <laughs> Fools, that's not funny. Hopefully he'll definitely leave now. He's about to get bitten by mosquitoes! <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. I know how to handle mosquitoes. Got such abs. Cassie, he's disgusting. Yeah, and nothing scares him. What do we do? Forget it. He won't last long in the swamp. He'll go looking for his bell and get lost in the bushes. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> oh no. I got my feet wet. At least you wash them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm going to sleep. Let's get out of here. Let him suffer. <laughs> I wonder if this idiot's already left. What? Is he completely out of his mind? I'm confused. What the heck is this? He's building a house for himself in the swamp? He thinks he's Shrek. Get out of here. Why did you settle down? Shh. You'll scare away all the fish. What fish? Don't you understand? We want you to leave our campus. Hmm, I wonder why. Only rich city kids go here. We do not need poor country people. Huh. Look at the fish this country boy caught. Could you do that? But I can pick up any girl. And all you get here is stinky fish. We'll see about that. If I want, I can pick up anyone. Uh, even Casey. <laughs> what? Huh? Cassie, don't even think about it. She's mine. <gasps> oh, what are you doing? <laughs> this fish will add a bit of rustic charm to uh, you. That's it. I'll do anything to get you out of here. Oh, it stinks. <laughs> try and try. You'll have no luck, you wuss. <laughs> Here. Ah, he thinks I won't be able to pick up Casey. What a joke. It's easier than easy. Ah! What are these stupid jokes? Let me go. There you go. You're my girlfriend now. <laughs> uh, dude, are you confused about something? <laughs> nope. She got caught in the lasso of love. She can't hide from me. What are you talking about, idiot? That's not a lasso of love. It's just a rope, and I'm not your girlfriend. This is how we pick girls in the village. So that's it, you're mine. Let her go, are you completely nuts? Don't even get close to her. A country bumpkin is no match for the queen of campus. Ew, Zach, why do you stink? Blech. 
Hmm. I stink? <laughs> Don't worry, Casey. He just went fishing with his face. <laughs> Get out of here. Don't bother us playing anymore. See you soon, Casey. We'll have more laughs. <sighs> uh, I saved her from Chris's lasso. So now she definitely won't say no to a date. Oh. I hope I don't smell like fish anymore. Okay, I need to act. <clears throat> Zach, what do you want? Uh, Cassie, hello. I wanted to ask, will you maybe go on a date with me since I saved you from Chris? Oh, and this is for you. What's this? Should I go on a date with everyone who helps me? Huh? Ew, Zack, that strange smell again. Well, I thought that we've been friends for a long time, and I'm interested in you. I, um... <sighs> I don't know. <laughs> Cassie, please! Well, fine. Only because I'm bored. Let's go, Elsa. <sighs> Thank you, Cassie! So, I brought you to the most expensive restaurant in the city. Stop! We have strict face control! You pass! And me? What's that smell? Yuck! Fish! I won't let you in! You'll scare off the guests! What? I am a regular customer! Let me through! I said no! We don't need any smelly people here! Well, thanks, Zack! You've embarrassed me! Wait! I'll think of something! <laughs> Please let us through! I am on a date! <clears throat> Sorry! Perhaps the smell isn't coming from you! Come in! Finally! Thank you so much! It's so nice when this fool Chris isn't around campus. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Hear that? Is that a chicken? Impossible! Someone's playing a prank! It's over there! <gasps> wow! It's Chris's chicken! Incredible! I thought it ran away! <gasps> Sweetie, who locked you in here? Don't touch it, it might be contagious. <laughs> Come here, let me pet you. Mia, <laughs> stop. <gasps> Catch it. Where is it? Where did it go? Let's run, we need to find it. It'll make a mess in our campus. <gasps> wow, they didn't want to let me into the restaurant. Good thing I climbed in through the window. Wait. What are they doing here? Is it a date? I can't hear what they're talking about. <laughs> she finds it funny. She's pleased. <laughs> She's really enjoying herself with him. Well, let her be. Let her hang out with her rich boy, Zach. Zach, you smell so bad, I just can't. Cassie, I'm telling you, it's not my fault. Chris slapped me in the face with a fish. I can't take it anymore. I'm going to throw up. First, wash yourself properly, then ask me out on a date. Elsa, let's go. Bye. Cassie, wait, I did wash, honestly. Oh. <laughs> Bella. There you are, Bella. Where is he? We need to tell him his chicken ran away. Let him go catch it. Oh, Bella, I've been looking for you for so long. <laughs> He's down there! Let's see what he's doing! Mm-hmm! Oh, my beloved hen! I feel so sorry for you! Ah! Oh! What did he do to the chicken? Uh, for country <gasps> folks, this is normal! He probably wanted to eat! We need to tell the principal that he's a butcher and a psychopath! Then they'll definitely expel him! Ah! Ah! Let's get out of here fast! <laughs> hey, Bella! Go take a walk, darling! Cassie, wait! Where are you going? I don't stink anymore, honestly! I don't care. You're just annoying me. I want to go home. Do I really irritate you that much? 
You stunk out my dog! Now she has to go to the groomer! Elsie, just don't get depressed! <laughs> Look! Chris's chicken! How did it get here? I locked it in the pantry! You locked an animal in the pantry? Are you a beast? Fine, Chris is an idiot, but what did the chicken do to you? Come here, sweetheart! <laughs> she let me pet her! Yuck! Aren't you disgusted to touch her? Look who's talking, Stinky! She's stressed after being in your pantry! She's stressed! <laughs> They're getting acquainted! Look! Unbelievable! Are you gonna play with her next? Huh? Hey, where are you going? We're going to play on the lawn. Bye, Zach. This chicken is driving me crazy. And that Chris. Uh, I need to find the others and figure out how to get rid of him once and for all. And the killer walks around with an axe. <gasps> hey, hey, you're ruining the atmosphere. There's no time for your stupid horror stories. We need to get Chris out of here. We're discussing Chris! He's mm -hmm. a maniac! What? We saw it ourselves! He picked up the axe and... Poor chicken! Shh. What chicken? I just saw his chicken outside! <laughs> a ghost chicken! A ghost chicken's on campus! <laughs> What's going on here? What's the shouting about? Oh, Miss Christy, Chris is a psychopath! He walks around with an axe! And tortures chickens! <laughs> uh, yes, I saw it myself! Uh, oh, he is dangerous! We can't live with him! What a nightmare! But do you have any evidence? I can't just kick him out! Of course! Come with us! We'll show you what a psycho he is! You'll yeah. do everything mm -hmm. yourself right now! Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm so glad that you two became friends. I love walking with you. <laughs> oh, wow. You became friends with my Bella. Congratulations. You're a brute. You left her alone and she was locked in the pantry. How could you? What do you want from me? My mom says if a girl has found a way to an animal, she's perfect. So what? So we're going to be together. Come with me to the farm. You'll like it. Are you out of your mind? I will never be with a bumpkin like you. I'm the queen of this campus, remember? Look at me. Oh, wow, you're beautiful. And take your chicken back, you idiot. Stay away from me. You walk now. Wow, she rejected me so harshly. Why are city girls so mean? Oh, Elsa, come to me. Don't touch her. You wanted to steal her, right? Have you gone mad? Why would I want her? Don't lie. I saw everything. You tried to kidnap Elsa. <gasps> Did you hear? Chris wanted to kidnap the dog. Oh, just imagine what he was going to do with her. <gasps> There's not enough evidence yet. This dog is just lucky. What if he had stolen her? We need to keep an eye on him. Let's get out of here. I can't take it anymore. They will never accept me here. I need to call Eva. Hello, my friend. I need help. What happened? The city kids are giving me a hard time. We need to put them in their place. No problem, buddy. I'm on my way. <laughs> That's <what happened>. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <gasps> who is she? Another country girl? But who is she? Maybe his girlfriend? Follow her. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. I don't understand. Who did you bring here? Uh, this is my friend. She came for a visit. Is that forbidden? What? You brought a cow here? A cow? What cow? There's no cow here. Coffee? Ugh. Oh, 
What a handsome man. Coffee? Mmm. <laughs> Homemade. <laughs> so where's the cow, anyway? What's with you and this cow? Here's your cow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mrs. Christie. <laughs> what did they do to the cow? <laughs> Explain what's happening! Why are they saying that you torture animals? What? I wouldn't hurt a fly! He was an honorable farmer in the village! Look here! I am expelling you from the campus! What? I don't know why, but I don't want him to leave! That's right, they have no business here! Well, though we could keep her… <laughs> Please, Mrs. Christie! Don't expel us! Give us one last chance! Only if it's the last! I forbid you to leave the campus! Only for studying! If you wander around, you'll go home! Clear? Of course! Of course! Thank you! <laughs> <laughs> Great! I need to lure them out of the campus and they'll be kicked out immediately! <laughs> Chris! Ah! Uh, Chris! What do you want? Yeah. Zach is having a party at the campus! Let's go, let's go! Are you crazy? We can't leave the campus. You want me to be kicked out? Oh, you live in a swamp anyway. Come on, Zach is so crush worthy. I want to go to his party. No. In case he will be there. Fine, you convince me. And how will we pretend that we're in the campus? What if Mrs. Christie comes? You know I'm a pro. Watch and learn. Here. Now we need to get out fast. Come on. Woo! Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Keep dancing. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Here we are. You again? How did you get here? Weren't you told to stay in the camp? Provincial magic. Want some pie? And Woo! fresh milk. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. Do you actually like this stuff? Yeah, it's really tasty. And all natural. And now we're going to bomb into the pool. What's that? Like this. Woohoo! Woo well, they're so cool. Let's hang out with them. Show-offs! And now, a slow dance! May I? <laughs> hey, I thought he wanted to ask me! <laughs> Darn! Eva was flirting with me all day and now she's dancing with Chris! Stupid! <sighs> Why are you sitting? Shall we dance? Oh, fine, come on. <laughs> so I'm the only one left without a partner? Casey's looking at you like that. She must be in love. Uh. No, she's actually staring at Zach. I want a drink. <sighs> oh, oh! What? Stupid Eva! She stole Chris from me! Come here now! Get off! Chris wanted to ask me, but you butted in! Stop it, Casey! Don't touch Eva! Oh, is she your sweetheart? Back off! You were just recently jealous of me with Casey! And now Eva? Girls! Break it up! I don't want to see you here anymore, hillbilly! We're leaving! <laughs> Bye, everyone! That's it! Get out of here! The party is over! Huh? huh? I said, get out! You're annoying! Well, that's it! I'll tell Mrs. Christie they ran away from camp! <laughs> annoying! They can get out of here! 
We lived peacefully without them. What's going on here? They ran away from camp. Okay, I see. I'm kicking them out. Gather their things. Let's take them to the dump. Wait, what are you doing? Don't touch Bella. Oh, are you defending them now? Why do you need this chicken? She's my friend, and Chris is my friend too, got it? Since when? You called him a hick. Chris is leaving, and it's all your fault. You ruined everything. Do something so that they won't be kicked out. You girls are really out of your minds. He annoys me. Bring him back. No, I have to throw out this junk. At least don't take the chicken to the dump. Here, deal with her yourself. Let's go, Mrs. Christie. <laughs> I need to hide Bella from these knackers. Oh no, where did Elsa run off to? Sorry, Bella, I'll miss you. Chris will come back for you. My poor little Bella. At least they didn't throw you in the dump. Poor little Eva. Casey beat you up. What are they doing there? Why is he hugging her? Enough. I'm sick of it. I want to study at this college. And if they don't accept me as I am, I'll become a city boy. What? You want to betray your country style? Yes. I'm fed up with everything. No! What did he do? Goodbye, Bella. Fly. Fly, Bella, fly. You're free. She said I won't be back. <laughs> Bella! Why? <laughs> Have you lost it? Chris, stop! You were born in the country and you'll never become a city boy. I will, got it? I'll get rid of everything that reminds you of my past life. <gasps> Stop! Don't, Chris! That's it. Let it all burn. <laughs> oh, what have you done? What came over you, idiot? I'm sorry, Eva. Now, I'm a city boy. Chris! Stop! Stop it! What do you want? I like you just the way you are. I don't want you to lose yourself. You... you like me? Stop, I'll come down. Don't leave. Elsa, Bella, you're back. <laughs> They're friends now. See, opposites do attract after all. Yes, just like you and me. I really like you, and I don't want you to change. And I like you, Casey even though we're from different worlds. What are you doing here, Chris? I expelled you from the campus! I'm not Chris. I'm, uh, I'm his twin brother. Uh, Nate. Hmm? Mm-hmm. I'm a city boy. I'll study here. Hmm? Oh, take this. Stay with us! <laughs> wow, where did you get all this money? <laughs> I printed it at the campus. <laughs> Shall we continue? Oh no! <gasps> I crushed a tomato! <laughs> yes, I carry tomatoes in my pocket! <laughs> What did you do to Cassie? Answer! I didn't do anything! It's a tomato! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we thought you were a maniac! It's okay, forget about it. Uh, where's Eva? <gasps> what? Watch it, I'm doing my makeup. And I'm freaking out. Mom, why are we so poor? We'll be rolling in cash soon. Did you find a job? No way. 
I'm going on a date with Nate, and today he's popping the question. Mom, seriously? You say that about everyone you date, and you're still not married! This time, I'm sure he's head over heels for me, just like I am for him. Yeah, 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 and you said that about everyone, too. Eva, don't ruin my mood. You, you don't, don't get, get it. it. As always, I'm a dumb one and you're the smart one. There's this guy at school who's always bugging me. He That's enough, Eva. Pack your stuff. We'll be moving to a fancy house soon. And I'm off to my date. Fine. Whatever. It's such a mess. Mmm. This salad is so delicious. And you look really beautiful. Thanks. Um, Cassie? Yeah? Um, tonight is pretty special. Yes, our third date. <sighs> Only the third? It feels like we've known each other forever. You feel that too? I sense we're soulmates. Uh, and I am really nervous. Oh, your palms are all sweaty. Uh, whoops, <laughs> my bad. <clears throat> Uh, I know this is fast, but I don't want you to be my girlfriend anymore. What? You don't want to? You're breaking up with me? Ah! I'm gonna be alone and lonely again! You're dumping me! No, no, no! That's not it! Not at all! I don't want you to be my girlfriend. I want you to be my wife. <gasps> wow! Will you marry me? Yes! Absolutely, yes! I'm getting married! <laughs> Eva! What's up? Why are you shouting like crazy? Did he dump you? No, he proposed to me! No way! That's insane! But I told you, I told you so! Uh, so, what's next? When's the wedding? In a couple of weeks, but… Uh, what? Spill it! I'm getting nervous! I'm getting anxious. We're moving into his fancy house right now! Seriously? Ah, we're gonna be rich! <laughs> yup! Ah, we're, we're going, going to, to a fancy, fancy house! house. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! <laughs> Dad, why are you so jittery? Uh, I'm nervous. What if Cassie and her daughter don't like it here? She's got a kid too? Yup. Relax. You said she's not rich, so she shouldn't be too picky. You do have a knack for finding some quirky woman, though. Donnie, watch yourself. I mean, she'll like it here for sure. I hope so. Okay, just be sweet. They're coming huh? in. They're already here. Take it easy, Dad. And here we are. Hey, sweetheart. My love. Hi. Eva? Donnie? Oh, so you guys already know each other. This is my son, Donnie. Nice to meet you, Donnie. I'm Mrs. Cassie. I'll soon be your mom. Uh-huh. Mom, this is the guy who gives me a hard time at school. So what? I think Eva and Donnie will become buddies. I'm sure of it. Right, kids? Mm -hmm. Yep. Eva, here's your room. Uh-huh. You don't like it? I actually like it. I just hate whose house it is. Got it. Huh? Um... What's this? These are gifts from Mr. Nate. Oh, cool. This is what I've been dreaming of. But seriously, he's Donnie's dad! Ah! I think I'll head out. Call me if you need anything. Uh-huh. Ugh! Oh, I need to call Tina. <sighs> Eva? Wow, whose phone did you snatch? No one's. It's a gift from my mom's fiance. Wow, the millionaire himself? Did you guys move in with him? Yep. Hey, where's the excitement? Tina, this millionaire is Donnie's dad. <laughs> what? He's your worst enemy! How are you gonna survive under the same roof as him? No clue. Just the thought of him being right next door drives me nuts! 
Darn it, out of all the women in the world, my dad had to choose the mother of this clueless pauper! <gasps> so what's your plan? Your mom won't pass up marrying a rich guy. Well, we, we need, need to, to break, break them, them up! up. I've got to call Aunt Kitty right now. <laughs> Catch you later, Tina. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Hey. Dang, Aunt Kitty isn't picking up. <sighs> okay, I'll send a text. Mm -hmm. Aunt Kitty, I need your help. I want to mess up my mom's wedding. <laughs> thanks, Th thanks a ton. That's it. <laughs> this blasted wedding is done. I'm gonna go grab a drink. Christy, is there anything to drink? Of course, just a sec. Darn it, looks like the cheese went bad. I gotta toss it. How about giving me a drink first? Sorry, my bad. Here you go. Finally, if you keep working this low, I'll have to fire you. Sorry, Donny. Oh, you're here too. Well, it is my house. My house, my house. Christy, my mom's asking for you. I'm on it. Can't your mom handle her own stuff? Oh, that's not your concern. It is when my housekeeper is bothered. Just leave me already. Why'd you even come here? Well, I actually live here now. And I'll go wherever I want. Ugh, what's that smell? Oh, this cheese needs to be thrown away. Are you serious? You're such a broke, clueless girl. That's a very expensive cheese. It is? Yeah, it is. But how would you know? You're broke and probably haven't eaten anything beyond breadcrumbs. I have. And I know what kind of cheese it is. And I actually like it. Sure, sure. <laughs> oh, how do these rich folks eat such junk? Maybe I just haven't acquired the taste. Yeah! What are you doing? Eating the cheese? It's expired! Seriously? But Donnie said... <gasps> He's such a numbskull! I'm gonna teach him a lesson! Uh! I'm so happy! Woohoo! Mom? Eva? Dreams do come true! Check out my room! It's gorgeous. And it's huge! It's bigger than our attic! Uh, yeah, but… What about these dresses? Have you seen them? And then what about me? Pretty cool, huh? Definitely, but are you sure this is what you really wanted? Absolutely! This is exactly what I wanted! Uh, maybe you're not into Nate. Uh, perhaps you'll look for someone else. What? Are you kidding me? Why look for someone else when he's perfect? Uh, well, maybe I'll find someone richer. Eva, are you for real? Where could I possibly find someone richer? Look at what the pastry chef whipped up. A rich cake linked out with diamonds. Um… Isn't a massive house, fancy cars, gold, and a boatload of cash enough for you? It's not about that! Then what's it about? See that massive gold bar just sitting there for decoration? What's not to like about our new life? Donnie! He's my worst nightmare! And now I have to live with him! No biggie, you two will become friends! No, he used to tease me only at school, but now he's doing it at home too! Do you want me to be miserable? Eva, you're blowing this out of proportion! Put on your new gear and head to school! Your classmates will be green with envy! Mom, you're not hearing me! Because you're talking nonsense! Come on! Mom! Mom! Come on! Okay, where are my jewels? <laughs> <gasps> wow! Yahoo! I'm a millionaire! <laughs> <laughs> huh, 
Eva, did you hit the jackpot or something? Nope. Eva, seriously, you look amazing. So cool. Then where did you get the cash? What's your deal, Zach? Your mom's marrying a millionaire. <laughs> I feel bad for the guy who will have Eva as a stepdaughter. <laughs> really? Then go sympathize with your buddy. <sighs> I don't get it. Eva's mom's tying the knot with Donnie's dad. What the heck? Oh, I need to see Donnie pronto. Such an idiot. Forget it. Zach is just jealous. This is awesome. And that purse. Can I have it? Of course. Take a look. Wow. This phone is so cool. <laughs> and loads of cash. <laughs> yep. Mr. Nate gave it to me for pocket money. I might even feel guilty for splitting him and my mom. So maybe don't do it? What do you mean? <laughs> I don't want to live under the same roof as Donnie. So uh, you want to live in a garage with bugs, starving, and wearing old clothes? No way. <sighs> then forget it and enjoy the high life. But what about Donnie? Who cares about him? In a year, we'll all be off to college and you'll go your separate ways. And Mr. Nate will keep giving you money for life. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you're right. Totally right. Just make Donnie's life sweet. <laughs> <laughs> What's with this nonsense? Good morning, Donnie. Your orange juice. What's with the music? Turn it off. Why is she messing up my place like this? Everyone knows it's a no-no to make noise till I'm up. Sorry, Mr. Nate gave her the green light. She's lost her mind. Woo! I love her this morning! Woo! Daddy, you too? Yeah! Keep playing with me! Uh, 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 uh. Ba, ba, ba. Oh, Teddy, sounds like someone's knocking on our door. Oh, hmm. No one's there. Ah, oh, this sound's coming from this way. <laughs> Who's there? Cut the music! What, what? I can't hear a thing over the music! Then turn it off! Sorry, can't! It's my morning ritual! Woo! <laughs> She's driving me nuts! Eva, open the door! Nope, you're mean! Open it, or I'll kick this door down! Donnie, what's all this commotion? Nothing, Dad. Just dealing with troublemakers. Open up! Donnie, knock it off! Why are you hassling Eva? She cranked up the music and woke me up! So what? It's already 10 in the morning! I was still sleeping! You never made a racket until I was up! Mm, well, maybe you shouldn't sleep in so late! Early risers do better! But it's my day off! So what? If I catch you bothering Eva again, I will cut your allowance! What? Dad! I've made myself clear! Uh. Here are your burgers! These are tasty! And she's already digging in! I'm not digging in, I'm eating! Yeah, like a pig! <sighs> Christy, where's my breakfast? It'll be ready in about half an hour! Half an hour? It should be on the table by now! Why does she get food already? Well, I got up earlier and asked the chef to prepare it! Oh, when will the hot dogs be ready? Yep, the chef's already working on them! We'll have some salad, pizza, and salmon! Awesome! You won't be able to eat all that! That's not your concern! Cancel the order! Have the chef make something for me to eat! I'm starving! But I'm hungry too! Never mind! I'll eat at the restaurant! Christy, tell them to get the limousine ready! Sorry! I can't do that either! What's wrong with the limousine then? I booked it to go shopping with my friend! But I always use it! Christy, get the limousine ready! I'm sorry! Mr. Nate already allowed Eva to take it! Uh, are you trying to ruin my life? No, that never even crossed my mind. I'm going to see Dad right now and you'll be in trouble! Pack your stuff and get ready to go back to your dump! 
I'm so scared, I'm trembling. <laughs> Dad! Donnie, since when do you just barge in without knocking? Sorry, Dad, but this is really important. What's going on? Did you print her picture? Well, yes. Cassie's going to be my wife. Um, uh, maybe you shouldn't marry her? What do you mean? Well, find someone else? How many girlfriends have you had? And how many is that? Do you think I propose to every woman I date? No. Actually, it's the first time you've proposed since the divorce with Mom. Exactly, because Cassie is the one. Well, you're smiling for the first time talking about someone. That's because I'm happy, and I want to spend the rest of my days with my beloved. Your antics... I got it, Dad. I won't pester you about Cassie anymore. I'm sorry. <sighs> Look at these shopping bags! Oh, I love shopping! <laughs> what are you doing here? Uh, I need to talk. What about, did I take something of yours again? No, I just want to say I won't bother you anymore. <laughs> what? And you expect me to buy that? I'm not lying. <laughs> Sure, right. You want me to believe that? We'll have a normal chat, and then you'll pull a fast one on me, won't you? No, Eva, n no more tricks. I want <sighs> our parents to get married. Uh, what brought this on all of a sudden? Dad really loves your mom, and I want him to be happy. Whoa. What if I keep getting on your nerves? Will you stick to your decision? No, it's important to me that Dad is happy, and if I have to put up with you for that, I'm in. It's fine. Plus, you're not that annoying. <laughs> oh, surprise, surprise. Turns out you're not a total ice block. <laughs> Did you really think I was? Oh, well, yeah. You don't care about anyone. You always get what you want, and you don't care if it hurts someone else. Do I really come across that way? Oh, yeah. Everyone notices it, especially how you used to bug me. Jeez, I'm sorry. Well, now that we're living together, I'll try to behave better. Well, then I'll stop messing up your plans on purpose. I knew you intentionally booked that limo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, I'll go. Won't bother you anymore. You're not bothering me anyway. But I'll, I'll still go. <laughs> wow, this place is amazing. It's like you're seeing such a house for the first time. I am. You're always visiting Donnie. Hey there. Give me your coats. <laughs> Thanks. Wow, they even have a housekeeper here. Hey. hey. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you come so early? The wedding is still an hour and a half away. Eva asked us to come early to help check if everything's prepared for the wedding. Well, I decided to come early for some company. What's there to check? Everything's fine. Fine? Nothing is ready here! Um, maybe they went with a, uh, minimalist kind of style? There's not even a wedding arch here! Uh, Donnie! What's going on here? Uh, let me call and check. Uh, hey, good afternoon. We have a wedding planned for today, but nothing is delivered yet? What do you mean it got rescheduled for next month? What? what? Are you kidding me? Nobody rescheduled anything! The wedding is today! Who rescheduled it? Yeah! Thanks! Do you want to explain something? Uh, what are you talking about? They just told me that you called two weeks ago and rescheduled the wedding! M my dad is really busy and asked me to contact you on his behalf. He would like to postpone the wedding date for six months. Darn, right. I forgot to call and change the date back. You forgot? Are you serious? So, is the wedding canceled? Oh man, I was looking forward to the wedding snacks. We need to call dad and cancel everything. <laughs> Darn it, he'll hate me. Hold on, nobody's canceling anything. We'll organize the wedding ourselves. But how? Um, you go and distract my mom. She must not suspect anything is wrong. I'll try. Uh, I can greet the guests instead of the host. Oh, 
Great. Uh, food. We need to arrange the catering. Uh, the chef had the day off. There was supposed to be catering. Uh-huh. We need to tell Christy to cook. Um, you and I will handle the decorations. Does everyone understand? Yes. 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 Now let's get to work. <laughs> Can you believe it? After all these years, I'm actually getting married. Hey there, Mrs. Casey. Wow. Uh, you look stunning. Thanks, Tina. Did you come for me? Well, sort of, but um, not really. Just wanted to check on you. Great. And I'm also ready to go greet the guests. Uh, not yet. Mm -mm. They haven't arrived yet? They have. No, they definitely have. Even your sister. My troublesome sister Kitty. The one I can't stand more than anyone else in the world. She's here. Hang on. I wasn't in talking. Your sister didn't show up. She's a no-show. <sighs> That's a relief. Stop! But you can't step out just yet. Why? Did something go wrong? I knew it. No! No, you're all good. Everything is just fine. Yep. All right, then let me go. No! I'm just... not... She must not suspect anything is wrong. Not feeling... well... <laughs> Tina! Tina, are you okay? I'll go get some help. No! Don't go. Just take me to the bed. Okay, let's go. Oh, man. Please entertain the guests. Gosh, why did I agree to this? I even suggested it. Uh, hello. The wedding happening here? Yep, right here. It doesn't quite look like it, though. And where are the wedding decorations? Uh, they're in another room. This is where the guests can chill while the bride and groom get ready. Uh, grab some drinks and take a seat. What do you mean getting ready? We should wait uh, for them. I don't know. What about the apps? Yeah, where are the appetizers for the guests? We spent a whole hour getting here. Uh, everything will be ready soon. Here we go. Uh. Are they taking forever with the decorations? It's almost done. Uh, what should I do with them? No mm. idea. Sing something. Bust out some rap. Oh, boy. And <clears throat> folks, uh, do, you uh, do you like, like rap? rap? Whoa! Is my little sister's wedding happening here? Uh, ma'am, I think you got the wrong place. You're the one who made the mistake by grabbing that microphone. Hello, everyone. I'm Kitty. The bride's sister, and I want to propose a toast. Baby boy, pass me a glass. Oh, I think we're heading for a disaster. So, my little sister Casey, she once married some fool and lost all her money. But her dream has come true, and she snatched herself a wealthy groom. I highly doubt she loves him, though. Did you hear that? I'm shocked. Oh, what are you doing? These are the groom's family. Get lost! So, she got what she wanted. But if Nate runs out of money, she'll ditch him. Get ready for all that. What? <laughs> what is this? This is so crazy. And you won't run out of money. Kitty? <gasps> <laughs> mm. What are you doing here? What do you mean? You wrote me saying you wanted to sabotage your mom's wedding. So here I am. I've got a secret weapon. <laughs> Darn it. But I wrote that three weeks ago. I thought you didn't read it. You didn't respond. What do you mean I didn't respond? I'm here. Auntie, I messed up. And... Donnie finished decorating everything. Dear guests. Please proceed to the wedding ceremony! Follow me! Finally! Yeah, no kidding! Faster! I love ceremonies! Can't you wait! Eva, hold on! I need to talk to my aunt! And we need to decide who's going to officiate the wedding! You! Me? Do we even have a choice? Let's go! So, how are you feeling now? Well, a bit better… Can I get you some water? Ooh, not necessary! I'm all good. All right, then I'll grab some water for myself. Oh, fine. I'll fetch 
fetch the water. <laughs> You're okay with that? No, no, no. I'm fine. I will fetch the water. There's no need to stress on your wedding day. <sighs> Why do I feel like they're hiding something from me? Eva? Oops. I think I walked into the wrong room. <laughs> Tyler? What are you doing here? Uh, I'm looking for our daughter. No. What are you doing at the wedding? At my wedding? Well, I didn't want to attend the wedding and see you marry someone else. But I realized that I still love you and want to be with you. Are you kidding me? You abandoned us, me and our daughter, and didn't show up for 12 years. Yes, I was young and foolish. I understand you may never forgive me, but there is still hope. It's too late for that. Don't you remember how well we were together? We were the perfect couple. <gasps> Leave Tyler and don't you dare show up at the ceremony. All right. If it makes you feel better. <sighs> Get it together, Cassie. Tyler is in the past. Today, you're marrying the perfect guy. Yes. I tried to follow your instructions precisely just like the pictures you sent. Donnie, it's perfect. <laughs> <sighs> Is the wedding going to start today or what? Of course it will. Zach, go to the altar. And make sure my aunt doesn't mess anything up. My mom can't stand her. Who even invited her? <sighs> I did. <laughs> Eva! By accident, you should just stay quiet. We almost had to cancel the wedding because of you. But everything's okay now. Come on, take your seat. Mr. Nate's coming. Hmm, the groom doesn't look too shabby. Uh, where's the priest? I'm filling in for him. Modern weddings don't need traditional priests. Relax. Phew, as long as Cassie is happy. Beautiful. Thank you. All right, let's skip the vows and get right to it. Let's do it. Nate, do you agree to take Cassie as your wife? I do. Why is my mom looking all over? There's some guy over there. Dad? What's he doing here? Cassie, do you agree to take as your husband, Nate? Um, Cassie? Miss Cassie, you need to answer. Me? What were they asking? Are you willing to marry me? I... I... I'm sorry, Nate, but you're not the one I truly love. <laughs> Let's run away from here. Let's run. Oh my god! Eva! What? What's your mom doing? I don't understand. Oh, so crazy. There you go, niece. Just like I promised. The wedding is ruined. I always knew Casey still loved your dad. <laughs> so you asked to ruin the wedding? Yes, but that was before our conversation. I had no idea that Aunt Kitty would bring dad here. Dad, wait! How are you? Leave me, all of you. What have you done, Eva? <laughs> this is delicious. I miss this. Miss the burgers? Missed us. Us being together. If you remember, our first date was here. And we had burgers, too. Oh, come on. This is the same cafe. Tyler, I adore you. Uh, so, you finally forgave me? Of course. I love you. And I love you too. Let's get married right now. Find the cheapest chapel and get married there. Well, that's a bit too fast. We've only just met again after 12 years. You're right. Then let's go to your house and discuss it there. Uh, well, to be honest... Uh, right now, I don't have a place. 
You don't have a home? I'm facing some temporary difficulties and I'm staying at a friend's place. And a job? Do you even have a job? I'm looking for one. Are you kidding me? You have no money, no home, and no job. How do you expect to come back to me? I thought... You thought I'd agree to live in a tent with you like a fool back then? Throwing a fit now? It was fine back then. No, it wasn't. You are so materialistic. No wonder we broke up. Then get out. Idiot. <gasps> oh, no. Nate, what have I done? He's not responding. I'm such a fool. <laughs> Well, we're back home again. Oh my gosh! Just yesterday, I was a rich girl, and now I'm stuck in this dump again! Well, at least they didn't take our stuff and phones. Seriously? Thanks a lot, Mom, for messing up our lives! It's all Tyler's fault, and your aunt who brought him here. Why the heck did you run away with him in the first place? You know Dad's a con artist, right? Yeah, I know, but I remembered how much I loved him and those feelings just came back. Great, now you'll be hungry all the time. I'm sorry, sweetie. <laughs> yeah, thanks to you, Donnie won't even talk to me now. Were you two enemies anyway? We were. But then we made up, became friends, and then, well, it doesn't matter now. Are you in love with him? So why are you just sitting here? Go to him. I offended his dad, not you. Yeah, but he doesn't care. And he won't want to talk to me. <laughs> My girly. I think Tina's here. Go check it out. Uh, hey. Tony? <laughs> Oh, I'll go see what's happening over there. Why did you come? Uh, to apologize for yelling at you. You're not at fault. I lost my temper. Well, I did invite Auntie. But Mrs. Cassie decided to leave my dad on her own. You didn't force her. Well, yeah. If that's it, don't worry. I'm not mad at you. A actually, it's not all. I like you, Eva, and honestly, I'm even glad you won't be my stepsister, so we can date. Date? I if you want to, of course. I want to, I absolutely want to. <sighs> yeah. Yes, at least my daughter will marry a rich guy. Wait, so my sister's wedding is happening here? <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes, you know. Look, nephew! <laughs> nephew! <laughs> Should we just get married right here, then? Uh, 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 no. <laughs> I get it, it's pretty quick. I was trying... <laughs> 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 oh, man. You always make 